Coming up next, a matchup for the UFC Light Heavyweight Championship of the World. You ready? You ready? All right, so two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight, they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about the finish takedown. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He is all about that left kick to the body. Good series of punches by him there. He has been busy throughout. He's doing a great job with the hands. He looks like a professional boxer out there. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. They're certainly getting after it early. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. What a punch. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, big left hook there. Nice kick there by St. Cruz. So just over 20 total strikes have already landed for Tiago Mahetta Santos. Nice hook lands. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Effective punch there by St. Cruz. Good fight here, under two to go. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys that found it, and they are fighting behind him real well. Tag him with a flush left. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Beautiful point. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh! Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Man, these guys are throwing back and forth. So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he was trying to take down that big. Oh, he might be out. What a round. All right, so a big round for him there. Maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there courtesy of the kick. DC talked us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. So round one in the books. Now we get to our okay, second right, round. Right, right, right. Tiago right. Santos. Let's fight. Versus Ovin St. Paul. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their... You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Able to check the high kick. Lands a big elbow there. Oh, straight right. Liver kicks, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Well, the numbers continue to pile up here. 56 total strikes have landed for Ovin St. Preux. 
And DC pretty accurate as well, landing at a 54% connection rate thus far. Oh! 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 I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Trying to get the knees going. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. That's a crippling shot there. Oh, he might be out. He needs to start looking to finish. Oh, oh, I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Birds over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on. Wow. Kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad. Head kick. Now he has to fight one more strike to end the night. up again here, but hurting. What a fight. That shot blocked by St. Cruz. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Oh! He's out! He's done, he's done. What a fight. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. All right, DC, no telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you gotta